All right, next we're going to add a site map. And as I mentioned before, site maps are very important because that's how search engines, robots, or crawlers like Googlebot can be able to find the pages in your, in your website, whether it's new pages or updated content to existing pages, as well as people. So let's go ahead and install a package, a component called XMAP. I'm just going to grab that from my hard drive. upload and install our right, install package was successful so now the next step is we have to actually create the sitemap so go to components xmap then you want to go to new I'm just going to type in your sitemap all right, the next part that you need to do is you want to be able to add the items on this particular sitemap now with this site I only have one sitemap but there are times when you have I'm sorry I have one menu there are times when you have several different menu options that you can link from so whatever menus that you have you can link to it from this page if I had more menus I have main menu you know and other menus at the bottom of this but since it's the only menu that I have, I'm just going to use this click. I'm check that. And for the priority, you can leave it at 0 0.05. And for the uh, frequency, uh, most sites, you leave this at weekly. So just leave that as is. But if you have a site where you're updating content much more quicker, then you, you can change this. But for now, for the average website, it's usually weekly. You don't want to have monthly because this you know it shows that you update your content you know monthly or update your site in so just leave that up there um, as weekly and then save and close alright once you're done if you notice you have this publish it's not published yet you have to X so to publish you click on it alright so that's published now you just want to click through this links make sure that everything works so let's start first with this one and that works check this one that works that one and they work okay so everything right now seems to work so I'm just gonna X those out and then next part is you want to go to main menu or whatever menu that you, you want your site map to be associated with All right, so I have this site map here. Go to menu type. Square at the bottom, locate the site map. Click on it once and then click on HTML site map. And then once you're done, you have to change, choose a site map, click on change. And then there's the site map that you have. All right, so save. And that's it. We've created a sitemap for this particular website. So now when you come on the home page and you click on the link sitemap we created, you get this nice basic sitemap here. So that's how you create a sitemap. Next, we're going to submit the sitemap to Google.